What's up, y'all? We're going to do another one for JJ. This one right here going to hit to the heart. That's what it's going to do. We, uh, what were we, I think it said 4.9 million in nine years. I think it should be about 49 million. But hey, that's just me. All right, y'all. JJ Lawhorn. Good old boys like us. This one. Y'all got some homies that you're missing. This one's for them. And he he does it right, y'all. This one's for the ones that grew up in the country and and just I got a lot of friends I I done lost, y'all. So I get a little emotional on songs like this and and some of the other ones I've did. And um addiction claimed them, drunk driving claimed them. So just and again, they had a different calling from Jesus, and they're fighting a different war, just in a different place. Their their time here was done. They had somewhere else to go. It's a progression. It's a progression. It ain't the end of everything. It's a progression. You go from here, then you go talk to. You're going to fight with the Lord, doing something else. And um, yeah. So we're uh. JJ Lauren, he uh, dude, he's shit. Like I said in another video, dude, he's one of the greatest songwriters right behind Church. Um, the, I I I think out. Period. This dude, he's gonna. I'm I've seen Church a couple times a concert. I'm always excited to see my boy, but I've never seen JJ Lawhorn, and this dude's gonna be. I don't know if he's opening up or they're gonna do songs together and or both. Either way, I'm fucking excited to see JJ in concert because I know this boy knows how to get put on a show. He said he's been playing old honky tonk, middle of the road or middle of nowhere bars, and yeah, yeah, oh yeah. Uh, that's where my freaking grandparents met was in a honky tonk middle of nowhere in North Carolina uh but and hey, if y'all know what I'm saying honky tonk that means somebody's horse barn that was out in a field in the middle of nowhere that they what didn't there was no liquor licenses involved ever and shit would get rowdy that's that's my line or family tree lineage hat whatever the fuck word you want to call it anyways let's get into this y'all let's do it Sitting on the toolbox in this short bed Chevrolet. I come out here to the county line when I need some time to think. And lately I've been thinking about a boy I used to know. He was taken from this world at 21 years old. When I look up at that photograph, see the smile there on his face. Well, man, it sure is hard to grasp, but I know he's in a better place. know he's got a place for us it's just it's different we we gotta have a little bud in our life and uh, well shout shout out that old fucking that old white chef he's just that's how you do it man you just where you go where you was with him where you hung out with him he's just putting the memories that's right there in the guitar just singing it, singing it. Ever get the feeling that they still hang around? Yeah, yeah you, you can almost feel them, though they're nowhere to be found. Some people tell me some. 
necessary. I mean, there's still things I do certain cars I see. It makes me think of my boy Tommy still every single freaking day. And I know he ain't there physically. Tell him, JJ. It's all in your head. But I say, hey, it's just their way of watching over us, my friend. Life goes on when we lose someone. Cause it ain't our time yet. But country folks just ain't the kind of people to forget. solo man put it on him and dude this video reminds me of my boy tommy smith jr he man his dad and my dad went to high school together and so we literally knew each other from when we was babies like i mean day one um and i mean god rest his soul he died of an overdose when he was 16 and he didn't know what he was taking he did not intentionally do it which most ain't i get that but this video like dude we played when we was kids in the middle of nowhere he had this freaking three-wheeler we almost killed, our, killed ourselves on like pretty much every day and like i mean we played and played i don't know i was just whew. yeah when i climb up off that toolbox and slide up in the seat I thank God for taking care of my buddy until the next time we meet God's got a spot in heaven for good old boys like us yeah they've always got our backs from somewhere up above because a country boy always looks out for the ones that he loves yeah god's got a place hey god's got a place yeah god's got a place for good old boys like us throwing that uh that OGOB in there for sure he uh he uh let's hear it. Is that it oh wait there it is oh shit get off there how do I get them stupid things off there in loving memory brother in Christ I can't see Justice Allen do it big in heaven stupid freaking things yeah man we all got us a freaking one we ones we miss man that is real shit right there JJ he thank you bro he still yeah like I said that carve in the original good old boy he threw that in there I wonder if he come up with that I don't know maybe he just did a little touch for the video either way he uh I love that song, man. He, um, amazing song, JJ. If you see, do see this, I know your social media. That I love it. I love it because in, Instagram used to say following zero forever. I think it says following one now. <laughs> uh, but still, like he he had a little bit of a rocker look with that leather coat. We all know he country hunt motherfucker. Uh, but still, just uh, yeah. Just give me a hard time, buddy. I love you, bro. Um, 
anyways y'all that's another one another one for y'all to go check out like I said if y'all have never seen this guy please go hit him up Spotify iTunes whatever it is please just listen to some of his other music please please this dude is an incredible he does everything himself incredible singer songwriter and he knows how to put some soul and heart into the lyrics y'all please go check him out love y'all have a good night